This is the Free Computer Consultant and this screencast is to show you how to take care of what you see right here on the screen. The message BoClean database is corrupted. Now this happens when for whatever reason the downloading of the BoClean database doesn't work and the backup file is also corrupted and seems to be happening to a lot of people lately. Now as you can see clicking on the OK just doesn't help. It just dings the speaker and and recenters the box. Now there's uh, a way that you can kind of get by if you don't know how to take care of this. You just grab the uh, dialog box by the title bar and just drag it off the screen and, and that can kind of work for a while because what it tells you to do is to uh, you select the updater but that doesn't work and the reason is uh, because the file is actually in use by this silly dialog. So what you have to do is actually kill the BoClean uh, services and you want to open Task Manager. And you can open Task Manager a couple of ways. You can either uh, right click on the uh, on the title bar down here, or on the task bar, excuse me, and select Task Manager. And you get the uh, click the Processes tab. And if you click on the image name, you'll alphabetize the list. And these are the two entries you're looking for, the, the boc425.exe and the bocore.exe. You need to end both of those processes. And you can do that by highlighting them and just clicking the end process or you can actually right click and say end process. And you get this nice little warning terminating your process, etc, etc. Are you sure you want to terminate? Yes. And that got rid of our uh, little pop-up dialog there that wouldn't go away, but you also have to get rid of this bow core. Right click, end process, select yes, and they're both gone. At that point you can close task manager, then you can go back over to your start and select uh, your programs, find uh, Commodore bow clean on there, and uh, you can select the updater. Can't seem to keep the screen in the right place there, but select the updater. Then you'll see the update available preparing to collect it. And ordinarily this will fix your problem and then when it's all done you have to actually launch BoClean again or reboot your PC. And we'll go ahead and try to start BoClean again, go to Programs, uh, Domino, BoClean, and select BoClean. And now you can see we've got our little BoClean icon back here and it's up and running. So that's all, that's all there is to it. It really is pretty basic, pretty easy. If you give it a try once, hopefully you won't have to do it again and again, but I have seen machines where you do. This is the Free Computer Consultant. Please visit my website at www.freecomputerconsultant.com for other videos and, and neat little tips and tricks and uh, other nice ways of helping your PC uh, experience be more enjoyable. Thank you for watching.